Here we go. <laughs> oh yeah. Hey everybody, and welcome once again to He Lived. Heaven's Live Video Devotional. I'm so glad you guys are here tonight. I hope you guys are having a good week. And with that being said, let's jump right into it. The word on the street tonight, okay, is coming from John, New Testament, chapter 15 and verse 2. All right, I'm trying to find that myself. John, okay, chapter 15 and verse 2. And the word on the street says, He cuts off every branch in me that bears no fruit, while every branch that does bear fruit, he prunes. So that will even be more fruitful. Cool. So recently, uh, my wife has been thinking about uh, picking up a new hobby, and you know she sews a little bit. She does a couple of things, but she really wanted to get down into the sewing. She wanted to really get get busy. I'm talking about a sewing machine, full out, making clothes from scratch. And so I was able to save up, and I bought her a sewing machine. And uh, you know she started getting busy learning with her mom and on videos. And this past weekend. Uh, she worked on so many things. She made a dress and it came out awesome. I mean, I'm talking about, I was like, wow. But the thing is that I never really knew what went into making clothes. I mean, you know, I see clothes every day. I've got jeans, I've got shirts, and I never really knew what went into making clothes because when I saw her on the table with the sewing machine, I just saw so many small pieces of fabric. I just saw a piece over here, a piece over there, this shape, that shape, all these small little pieces of fabric all over the table and I'm thinking like what is that is that the dress and she's like yeah that's gonna become the dress one day and on top of that you've got to do a bit of planning uh, before you begin you got to kind of plan it out because you don't want to just start cutting and sewing and you're not gonna actually have the the desire that you want and so the basic theme though is that you've got to uh, start with one piece of fabric you know one big old square or rectangle whatever it is then you cut out the various pieces like perhaps to match for a sleeve or like a collar, all these various pieces, and then you redesign them into the outfit of your choosing. The fabric is bought whole, so one big piece, and it has to be cut to be made into the beauty that it one day will become. And you and me are also like this fabric, with God at the pedal of the sewing machine. We come to him appearing whole, but we're in truly need of redesigning. He also cuts us, he breaks us down, into these various pieces, pieces of our character, our personality, our experiences, and then assembles us together as he sees fit. These cuts do hurt at times. They, they, they rub us in the wrong kind of ways, but these trials, these experiences in life serve as those cuts in the fabric, and they are an opportunity for joy over the work that's happening in us, as well as how God will receive the glory for what you have become. And so I want you guys tonight to allow God to run the sewing machine in your life. You guys have a good night. Now it's for you I will live. It's for you.